This is Bo. Bo is plain. Very orderly, but plain. Life has always been a routine for Bo. He brushes his teeth with exactly 120 strokes every day. He eats two slices of plain toast every morning. He wears only solid colored button downs, always done to the top button. His life is mundane, but that is the way he chose to live. This is Lucy. Lucy! You're late for practice! Ever since Lucy was little, her parents have always pushed her to play sports. Volleyball, basketball, tennis, rugby, water polo, she's tried it all. But unlike her family, who were naturally sports inclined, Lucy always struggled. Lucy, how can you even be a part of this family if you can't even play sports? Come on, get up. Lucy had always been different than her family, but that was normal for her, until one night. Lucy, you're adopted. Who are you? I'm Lucy. What are you doing in my treehouse? I'm running away from home. Why would you do that? It's not like my home is bad or anything. It's a very nice home, but my parents just showed me this. You're adopted? Yes, but I want to find my real mother, so that's what I'm going to go do. Where does she live? Spring Creek. You're walking all the way to Spring Creek? Yes. You're walking 15 miles and you brought a hair dryer? Well, I want to look nice when I meet her. That won't do. I have two hatchets, a propane burner, 19 feet of braided rope, two sleeping bags, 13 pocket knives, 33 matches, list strike box of course, and a small boiling pot that my dad used to use. It has a small hole in the bottom, but we can fix that. We? Yeah. You'll never make it there by yourself. I'll help you. Well, you can come along if you want, but I can't promise your safety. I can handle danger. Where'd you guys get this camping gear? Well, my dad and I used to go out in the woods and camp together every weekend. Well, why did you guys stop? He died when a large shell fell on him four years ago. Dad! Bo, I'm, I'm sorry. It's, it's fine. We should probably go before my mom gets home.
camp here. The sun will set at about 1900 hours, and that means 7 o'clock. Okay. We need sleep. I say we break camp at 0700 tomorrow. That's seven o'clock. That'll give us enough time to make it to Spring Creek by tomorrow afternoon. How do you know we're not lost? We can tell which way is north by the moss on the trees. Hmm. There doesn't seem to be any moss on this tree. Look, there's Spring Creek right over there. We actually found it. May I help you? What's a lovely couple like you doing here? We were hoping to find someone. Uh, Susie Jones, is she home? Uh, I think Susie Jones used to live here. She's gone? Well, I could get you some directions on how to get to her home if you'd like. Oh, that would be great if you could. My friend and I would really appreciate it. Ohio? Lucy, Ohio? That's two states away. How are we supposed to get to Ohio? You said Spring Creek and that is all. They're probably worried about me now. We need to go home. We should go home right now. I don't usually freak out like this, but we need to go home right now. I'm not Crime brulee, oh, give me face. Oh, this is crazy. How are we, how, how are the, uh, where are we going? Come on. Lucy, drive! He's coming! You do know how to drive, don't you? I drove into J.C. Penney's parking lot with my dad once. Let me drive. Hey! Hey, dude! That's my car! Can't win them all. Lucy, this is serious. Do you understand what we just did? We just committed a crime. Grand Theft Auto, Lucy. What is my mom gonna say? This is serious and you're not even saying anything. My mom's gonna kill me. What? You're kinda cute when you're mad. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> A rhythm and rush these days where the lights don't move and the colors don't fade. Leaves you empty with nothing but dreams. 
In a world gone shallow, in a world gone mean In a world gone shallow, I say we set up camp here! There is a truth and it's on our side Dawn is coming, open your eyes Look into the sun as a new day's rise Was that a phone? What are you doing with this? Our parents could track us. What are you doing, Moosey? You should have left that at home. Aren't you supposed to be a survival expert? Yeah, I am. That's why I brought the phone. If we get into trouble, we need to be able to call for help. Maybe I don't want help. Moosey, we are in this together. We've come so far already. I'm gonna go look for my phone. anything? No. But I have some sardines in my backpack that we can eat. You want some? No thanks. Suit yourself. Wait, how are you gonna cook those? What? We're gonna have to leave here by 0900 sharp if we want to make it to your mom's house today. What? We're runaways and you're making a schedule. I guess. But seriously, let's pack up, eat, and leave. Why wouldn't she? She chose to give me up! I don't think I can do this. Lucy, we can do this. Put your head on my shoulder Hold me in your arms Baby Squeeze me oh so tight Lucy, we're almost there. Oh. What was that? We're out of gas. Well, I guess we're walking.
Well, I guess this is it. This town owned in a month, she'd say, as her eyes gazed over the tattered drill. They used to flow for days, were blistered and torn, with our conversations warm. She smiles in a Mona Lisa sort of way, and we are polarized, inconsistent, waiting for the fallout, and we are polarized. I listening to the bad, the old, the vacant sounds. Listening to the bad, the old, the vacant sounds. Listening to the bad, the old, the vacant sounds. Listening to the bad, the old, the vacant sounds. Listening to the bad, the old, the vacant sounds. Polarized. 